This body cam footage shows the moment a suspect stabbed a Hillsborough County Sheriff's deputy in the neck. On October 11, 2020, deputies responded to a home to assist mental health professionals with an involuntary mental health evaluation. The suspect was originally cooperating with deputies and the evaluators. After an hour of evaluation, and upon learning he would be admitted for treatment, the suspect fled from the home on foot into a heavily wooded area. The deputy pursued him on foot, while another deputy followed in a police unit. After a brief pursuit, the deputy contacted the suspect on a wooded trail and attempted to calm him down. White male, black gray hoodie, black man. Are you scared? Yeah. Hey, look, running's not gonna help, all right? One, I run a lot, okay? On the side trail, I'm here with him, hold on. Look, we're gonna walk back, okay? Okay? Now, the thing of it is, you're still not in trouble, but obviously I can't trust you not to run anywhere. All right, so come on, come on. I'm gonna put you in handcuffs for now, okay? Hey! He stabbed me! He's got a knife! Hey! Stop! Stop! Stop it! Stop! Stop right now! I got my gun point! Stop right now! Stop! Nick! Stop! Stop right now! Put it down! Drop the knife! Throw it to the side! Put your hands behind your back! Put it behind your back right now! Put your hands behind your... Put your hands behind your back now! Turn over! Turn over! Julian, 33. Am I bleeding? Huh? Am I bleeding? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you got you okay? Uh, I don't know. What happened? You reached around and stabbed me. Get like a... Go, 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 go. Put me in the medical. Put me in the medical. Julian, 33. Uh, I got stabbed in the neck. Get your EMS rolling this way. Send him. Here. I got a quick clap. Here. 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 Is it bad? It's not bleeding bad. Okay. All Give right. It it's good. Hey. Pressure. That's good. Stay with him. Stay with him. Here. I'm good. The suspect was taken to the hospital for evaluation. After being cleared, he was then booked into the jail for attempted felony murder of a law enforcement officer, resisting an officer with violence, resisting an officer without violence. The deputy was treated for his injuries at a local hospital and released the next day.